My name is Ian McGovery. I'm a researcher and a surgeon at University Health Network, University of Toronto. Liver cancer is a deadly and rapidly growing problem in Canada. In fact, in the last few years, liver cancer has been the only cancer to increase in both men and women. Since 1970, liver cancer rates in men have tripled and they've doubled in women. Our treatment options are limited and we know that we won't be able to cure the majority of people with primary liver cancer. In part, this is because primary liver cancer is very good at hiding itself from the host immune system. It does this by manipulating the cells of the immune system and turning them into tumor-associated macrophages. These tumor-associated macrophages tell the rest of the immune system, it's okay, move on, nothing to see here. In a very real way, they shield the tumor from the rest of the immune system. We hope to change this by engineering nanoparticles that will specifically target and treat the tumor-associated macrophages. Nanoparticles are tiny engineered particles made out of metal. They are engineered to be between 1 and 100 nanometers in size. For the sake of perspective, that's about 50,000 times smaller than the diameter of an average strand of hair. The fun thing about nanoparticles is we can engineer them to do pretty much anything. We can get them to carry medications, carry DNA, dissolve, vibrate, and we can use these properties to target individual cells. And we know from work that we just recently published that nanoparticles are ideally suited for targeting cells in the liver. In the case of primary liver cancer tumor associated macrophages, we know that these cells are particularly prone to eating things. To a certain extent, they eat things that otherwise would attack and kill the tumor. So we plan to use this behavior to our advantage. We will design nanoparticles that the tumor associated macrophages really want to eat. And we'll engineer them so that once they are eaten, they will kill the tumor associated macrophages. In this way, we hope to unshield the tumor from the host immune system. We hope to make it more vulnerable both to chemotherapy and to the immune system in general. With the support of the Canadian Liver Foundation and the Toronto General and Western Hospital Foundations, we plan to design and test out nanoparticles to target and treat primary liver cancer tumor-associated macrophages. There are a whole bunch of questions we have to answer to do that. We have to figure out what kind of nanoparticle to use, what size and shape is best, how best it can kill the tumor-associated macrophages. But in the end, we hope to get this out into clinical trials quite quickly so that we can develop an effective anti-cancer treatment.